Are you looking for the best budget smartwatches? In your budget, well in today's video we break down the top 5 best budget smartwatches. I made this list based on their price, quality, durability, and more. To find out more information about this product, you can check out the description below and also make sure you subscribe for more reviews. Okay, so let's get started with the video. The fifth product on our list is the Fitbit Versa 2 Health and Fitness Smartwatch. Those looking for a budget smartwatch that's more focused on fitness should get the Fitbit Versa 2. Fitbits have long been among the better fitness trackers, and the Versa 2 is a perfect example of why. It has a suite of fitness sensors, including a heart rate monitor, blood oxygen sensor, skin temperature sensor, and more. It can track a huge range of workouts, including swimming, and it's great for tracking sleep. All that data syncs with the Fitbit app, which offers excellent fitness analytics, especially for those willing to pay for Fitbit Premium, the Fitbit subscription service. Like some of the other watches on this list, the Fitbit Versa 2 is inexpensive because it's one of Fitbit's older devices and at times, it can feel like the Versa 2 is aging a little. It also doesn't have a built-in GPS, but it can access GPS information from a connected phone. If you want standalone GPS for example, if you don't plan on taking your phone on your workouts, you'll need to buy a different device. But if you can live with its limitations and want something with excellent fitness tracking features, the Fitbit Versa 2 is the budget smartwatch to buy. Up next in the fourth place is the Garmin Lily Stylish Small Smartwatch. If you want a smartwatch that looks more stylish than most of the competition, buy the Garmin Lily. The Lily is built specifically for women and has a smaller build and comes in a range of colors. It's not as advanced as some other watches on this list, with a grayscale display and no built-in GPS. However, it does excel in other areas like, for example, when it comes to fitness tracking. The Lily can track basics like heart rate and steps, plus it leverages Garmin's stress tracking and body battery tracking tech. One of the best things about the Garmin Lily is its simple interface. You'll navigate the device with its built-in touchscreen, and most will find it easy to scroll around. Additionally, the Lily has a long battery life, which Garmin pegs at 5 days. It might not last that long for some users, but even a few days is better than having to charge it every night like some other watches. Plus, the Lily offers a more refined design than most of the competition, and is thus worth buying for those who prioritize style. The third product on our list is the Samsung Galaxy Watch 440mm smartwatch. Those looking for a budget smartwatch for Android should look past the latest models and get one that was a flagship just a few years ago. The Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 was one of the best smartwatches of its time, and while it's not as great as the Galaxy Watch 6 the current generation, it's still an excellent smartwatch overall. It has excellent fitness tracking features, including the ability to track things like body composition and even blood pressure. Its sleek round design looks great on any wrist, plus its software is easy to navigate. It does work slightly better with Samsung phones than other Android phones, considering that it comes with all Samsung apps out of the box, but Android users in general will be able to use the vast majority of features and functions. There are some minor downsides to buying a device that's a few years old, but at this price point, not that many. The Galaxy Watch 6 has a few more advanced fitness tracking features and better battery life, for example. And the Galaxy Watch 4 is a little expensive compared to some of the other options on this list. However, if you want a highly functional budget smartwatch to use with your Android phone, the Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 is the smartwatch to beat. Second on our list is the Amazfit BIP5 smartwatch. This entire review is about budget smartwatches, but if you really want to save money, the Amazfit BIP5 is the one to buy. This device isn't as high-end as the Apple Watch C, but it still gets all the basics right. It has a nice-looking screen and will easily show you your notifications and allow you to interact with your phone, although it won't allow iPhone users to reply to text messages from the watch itself. The device has an excellent battery life, which Amazfit rates as being 10 days. Of course, this depends on how the watch is used. The BIP5 is also great for fitness tracking, with a range of built-in fitness sensors, including sensors for heart rate and blood oxygen. It can track most workout types, although it's not really built for swimming. It does have some level of water resistance, but you'll want to keep it out of the water as much as possible, including when you shower. 
Still, unless you are specifically looking for a device to track swimming, if you want a great smartwatch that comes at a super low price, the Amazfit Bip 5 is the one to buy. Finally, the top product on our list is the Apple Watch C 2nd Gen. The Apple Watch C is Apple's budget smartwatch, offering many of the same features as the higher-end Apple Watch models, but at a much lower price. The Apple Watch C keeps the same overall design as other Apple Watches and has many of the same fitness tracking features. It'll track metrics like heart rate and movement in the background, and it has a huge range of workout types built in. The Apple Watch's software, WatchOS, is well designed and easy to navigate, and it integrates deeply with Apple's services, so you'll find it easy to access your music, send messages, and more. It has Siri built in for voice control too. Because the Apple Watch integrates with Apple's ecosystem, it only syncs with an iPhone. And as far as budget smartwatches go, this one is on the pricey end. However, if you have an iPhone and don't mind the $250 price tag, the Apple Watch C is easily the best budget smartwatch, thanks to the fact that it offers most of the flagship Apple Watch experience in a much cheaper package. Thanks for watching, and that's all for now. I hope to see you guys in the next video. Till next time.